What's up you guys? Good to see you here on the channel. As always, what an interesting day I have had today. So, dealing with something a little bit new, um, not the most fun thing to deal with, that's for damn sure, but we had a lady come into grassroots, unbeknownst to me until today, twice this week. And um, let's see, how can I explain this without getting in a lawsuit? So um, I came in the back door, talked to Cam, and uh, just seeing how her day was going. She said, hey, I think that lady right there is stealing plants. I said, really? I mean, the middle-aged white lady, not your typical person you would think was a, a thief, dressed pretty nice. So um, uh, she did have a big pocketbook with her. I said, well, let me just go talk to her and see if maybe I can see some plants in the pocketbook. You know, I didn't want to accuse anybody of stealing when I hadn't seen it, you know, with my own eyes. So I spoke to the lady, hey, how you doing? You need any help? And uh, she got pretty nervous at that point. She did have a $120 plant uh, already up at the register that she was gonna buy. So she said, oh, well, I'm just I was just shopping around, but I've got a plant up there. I'm gonna go pay for it and, and get out of here. So I didn't, wasn't able to go back and review the footage until later that day. And sure enough, the lady's going around and uh, methodically, like she must have made 50 laps out here in the jungle greenhouse, but she's going around ripping leaves off of my plants and stealing top cuts. Uh, it just blows my mind. Like I'm a nice guy. If you need a plant or want a plant and I have a mother plant or something in the background, long as it's not a crazy expensive plant, hell, I'll give you a cutting. I love plants, y'all know me. I love people, I love for people to have plants. But don't come in my greenhouse and steal from me blatantly. And um, so a little fast forward, this was like a couple of days ago. Um, we found out who it was, made contact with them, and I spoke to the lady on the phone. I was like, look, um, you know, I've got cameras everywhere. I saw you stealing these plants. And I might put the phone conversation on here too. I'll probably just have to bleep out her, her name or whatever, but uh, you know, she would not admit to stealing the plants. Said she found it on the floor. Somebody told her she could have it. And just, you know, nonsense. I'm like, look, I saw you stealing the plants, but she just would not fess up to it. And I guess that's the reason why I'm making this video. You know, if she'd have fessed up to it, she did pay for the damaged plants and just apologized for the damage. But uh, anyway, I, I just don't understand people these days. I mean, I've had theft at my other businesses. Didn't think anybody would steal plants from me, but um, it looks like people will steal just about anything these days. So here's some of the footage. I might put the phone call on here. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments what you think. And uh, here it is. All right, so here we are on Monday. Now, uh, some of the employees said, hey, after watching the video from Valentine's Day, which was when I actually uh, spoke to her, they said, hey, she was here Monday too. I said, oh crap, well, we better go back and review that footage from Monday. And this is where you could see her take a cutting and actually just shove it in her pocket. I'm gonna fast forward it a little bit here, but she's just looking at all the plants, checking them out. Let's see, let me hit play here. And I think this is actually when she's doing the breaking of the cutting, possibly. Yep, see, there you go. Now we're gonna just shove it right in our pocket. Don't tell me you ain't stealing plants, lady. Man, come on. We'll put it in slow motion. Look, leaves hanging out of the pocket. Give me a break, lady. Look, leaves flapping around. Leaf, she ain't even got it all the way in her pocket yet. Come on. All right, so that was Monday. Now let me go to Valentine's Day footage. All right, so here we go. We're on Valentine's Day now. And same lady, same shirt, <laughs> I believe, is uh, back in the greenhouse. I'll probably blur her face out in these videos because I'm not trying to ruin anybody's life or have another lawsuit so we'll <laughs> we'll just blur her face out but anyway for sure 
the same lady and she just makes trip after trip around the greenhouse just picking up plants scoping the place out and uh you know she must have made i don't know 15 rounds around the greenhouse just checking everything out okay she makes her way back here to the back area sorry i'm trying to do the camera i mean do the computer and hold the camera at the same time and she really likes this billetai and you'll see what she does to one or two of them here in just a little bit okay she walked away for a second now she's back looking at the philodendron the billetai let's see if i can zoom in a little bit she spins it all around and then right i think it's right here she starts breaking leaves off because she wants to get her a clean cutting so uh, i'm pretty sure this is where she's actually snapping some leaves off trying to make it a little bit uh easier to steal yeah okay she's gonna come back to it here in just a second but i think she de-leafed it a little bit right there then she just walks around the store some more she must i don't know she makes like 50 laps but she wants the jopii which is on this table over here so she starts checking them out she's gonna come back to that one in just a little bit too but man she was busy thank goodness she didn't take my red moon right there because that's a 500 hundred dollar plant all right, I believe here in a second. Okay, we have some more customers come in and she goes back to the billetize and inspects them a little bit more. Okay, still trying to find a good pinch point on that thing so she can break it off. And I think these other customers come through and kind of mess her up for a second. But she ain't gonna let nobody stop her. And keep in mind, Cam is back in the greenhouse at this point too. So she's gonna look around a little bit and uh, okay, let's see what we got going on right here. Can I break that? Let's see. Uh, I can't remember. I've watched this thing just a couple of times. I can't remember exactly when she actually gets it. This might be, be it, but those things are not, t not easy to break off. There went one leaf. You see the leaf fall down on the ground right there. Let's see yep okay let's go ahead we'll just stick that in our purse and you can see her really good here on a in a minute we can for sure you know no doubt stick it in her purse all right so she's coming back to the billetized now and i think this is when you can like really see her grab it and uh for sure stick it in her purse gonna look around a little bit Oh yeah, there you go. Stick it in that purse, lady. Golly, that just makes me mad all over again. And then she picks up the broken leaves and watch what she does, y'all. Watch this. Sticks them back <laughs> in the pot. Thanks, lady. Appreciate you cleaning up after you're stealing. Jeez, man. It's hard to watch this again, you know? Really, really is. Okay, so she's made another lap around the greenhouse, and this is when she really goes after this jopi. I mean, she wanted this thing really bad, but she's always looking around, and then she really is going after this one. I mean, but that thing has got a crazy thick stalk to it, but she is just trying her damnedest to break that thing. I know I probably, I, I know I blurred her face out, but. She is just making this grimace look like she's so <laughs> trying so hard to pinch this thing off, man. Yeah. Let's see. Let's give it one more try. So she's back again. Really, really trying to get after that thing. She's going to have to work on her, her thumb and forefinger muscles, her pinching muscles. And needs to work on getting some of the, that sticky that glue off them fingers too is what she really needs to work on, but she couldn't break it. So I think she pretty much gives up at this point. Okay, so here's when I come in. And, um, you know, again, I didn't want to accuse anybody uh, because I didn't see her actually steal it. I mean, now obviously we all know that she really did, but she, uh, she made quick work of getting out of the greenhouse at that point. She's like, okay, I think I've worn out my welcome. 
And, and there you have it. What are we going to do, folks? I don't know. Hello, it's Ryan. I think it's been a big misunderstanding, but all I need to do was, because I was there yesterday and I bought that very expensive plant. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, and, yeah, I remember talking to you. Yeah, and there was a piece of plant broke off. Mm -hmm. It was on the floor, and I went to give it to the boy in the green sweatshirt. He said, well, they don't throw it away. He said, you can have it for a second in my pocketbook. If I need to bring it back, I will. Well, so look here. So I've got cameras in that jungle greenhouse. I right. understand that. And matter of fact, I was just reviewing the the footage and it's blatantly obvious without any shadow of the doubt and that's why i wanted to review it first before making it i did after i asked somebody i did i put it in my purse yes ma'am but, but you went around and got a couple of pieces and, and i just watched you do it just right before you okay. you called I, you know i mean i saw you I, break the leaves off and, what do i need to do to make it right i'm not well i mean i'm a i'm a i'm a nice guy i really Hell, if you would have asked me for some cuttings, if I would have had them, I would have given them to you. But you know, I can't just have somebody coming in. And well, I, like I say, I bought that very, very expensive plant yesterday because my husband had gave me some money to give him buy some Right. Yes, ma'am, and you told me that. But the problem I have is, is the other, you know, three plants that you broke, and and stole. And then I also had to go back and review uh, Monday when you were here, and I just saw you saw you. Sticking a uh, you know a plant in your pocket on Monday, you know. So um, how much do I, how can I just pay for it? Whatever the expense was. Well, I, you know, you're telling me that these pieces were laying on the ground, but I just watched it with my very own eyes. Oh, it's that one was, but I, I'm not going to argue with. I mean, I mean, I, I've never stole anything in my life. But anyway, I'm well, not going to argue with that. But anyway, well, ma'am, ma'am, you did because I just watched you. So I mean, I would re I would respect you more if you would just you know own up to it versus trying to say well it was a piece on the ground or or what have you. You know I'm okay with just uh, you know you making it right and paying for the damages that you did. You know I don't want to turn this into okay. into a big old thing, but I would res I, but I would respect the fact you know that you admit that you actually you know stole plants, which you know you did because we just watched it on on film. You know, I don't want you to insult my intelligence and tell me that. I'm not insulting your intelligence. I'm just asking you, what do I need to do to pay for what I damaged? Okay, well, I guess, uh, you know, I guess $300 would, would probably cover it, but you know, you wasted a lot of my time, a lot of my staff's time, and, um, you know, I'm not asking you to compensate for that, but, uh, you know, what I really would like, for, and I'm not trying to get you to admit that you stole or anything on the phone, but, you know, it just pisses me off that you you know, you won't say that, you know, you know what you did. I mean, I just watched it and, and uh, you know. I did put it in my pocketbook. Well, I'll tell you what, well, if you want to play it that way, we'll just, um, you know, I guess we'll just get some credit card information and. I mean, I can, I mean, I can give you, I don't live in town, but I can come right over there and pay you or I can give you my debit card information right now. All right. Um, I'll tell you what, you just, I don't, I don't want you back on my property. I'm just going to write your, you give me your credit card information and I'll just go ahead and, and charge it for $300 and we go on about our own direction. I apologize for any inconvenience I've caused. Uh, I will be gladly not to come there anymore. I, like I said, I don't live there. I just came when I visited my daughter. Well, I apologize if I did anything wrong. Well, you know you did. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead. No, I had people calling me this morning saying, you're all over Facebook. I said, what? Well, it's because we didn't know who you were, and I wanted to know who was stealing my plan. You think if, you think if I would have done something wrong, but anyway, that's... That's the part that's really aggravating me about okay. this situation. I mean, I've got clear footage of you breaking the plan and then putting it either in your... You put one in your pocketbook, and then I got you on Monday breaking it and shoving it in your pocket. I mean, there's zero doubt. The cameras, okay. the cameras don't lie. I mean, you know it just as well as I do what you what you've done. That's the part that that's okay. kind of sticking in. Well, I'm just gonna charge it to 300 for the damage you did did to the plants, and then I just okay. I, I just respectfully ask that you not come back on my property. And if it's more than 300, you know, just let me know. No, I'm I'm a fair I'm a fair person. To what I'll, I'll do what I say okay. I'm gonna do. All right. All right. I appreciate it. Have a good day. You too. Bye. Bye. -bye.
So there you have it. Um, I mean, y'all saw the footage too. There's no doubt that she was stealing plants. I wouldn't dare, uh, you know, accuse anybody of something that I didn't have 100% proof of, but y'all saw it too, man. I don't know. What is this world coming to, man? Don't steal my plants. I think what we need to do is train our buddy Larry over here to, uh, Larry, can you say thief? Thief. Brah. Maybe then you can make a police siren sound or something. <laughs> I don't know, you guys. I'm tired. I'm ready to go home, get me a beer. Appreciate you watching. The more you know, the more you grow. I'll see you guys on the next video.